Hey everyone, this is Valentin from MusicRightness.com and in today's lesson we are going to learn Jungle by Drake and it sounds just like this. Alright guys, so in this first part, we are going to cover the verse of the song. We are in the key of E minor. So let's see the chords. We start on A minor 9. Playing octave A on the left hand and G, B, C, E on the right hand. Following this chord, we'll play this B minor 7. So we play octave B on the left and D. F sharp, A, B on the right. Then we'll play again an A minor 9, but this time the right hand is going to change a little bit. We have B, C, E, G, and the left hand keeps an octave A. Then we'll play a B minor 7 again. The right hand also changes, so we have A, D, F sharp, and we keep octave B on the left hand. Alright, so right after this chord, we'll play this D minor 9 chord. So we have a single D on the left hand, and we play C, E, F, A on the right. Then we'll play this C major over F sharp. So we have octave F sharp on the bass, and a simple C major triad on the right hand. C, E, G. Very nice. Following this chord, we'll play this G9 add 13. So we play octave G on the left, and then on the right hand we'll play B, E, F, A. Third, thirteenth, seventh, and ninth. Then we'll play this C major 7 chord, playing this octave C on the left hand and B, E, B on the right. Very nice. Following this chord, we'll play this E7 flat 9. We play an E bass, single E on the left, and D, F, G sharp, B on the right hand. We can also view this as a diminished D chord over an E bass. And we'll finish this chord progression over this C major 7 chord. So we have a C on the bass and C, E, G, B on the right hand. Very nice. Alright guys, let's repeat all the chords together. So we start on A minor 9. Then we'll play this B minor 7 chord. Then back to A minor 9, but we change the right hand. And now we play B minor 7. From here we play D minor 9. Into this... C major over F sharp. Then we'll play this G9 add 13. That will resolve into this C major 7. Very nice. Then we'll play this E7 flat 9. And we'll end up on this C major 7 chord. Very nice, guys. Okay, so now let's see 
what we actually play in the verse. We start like this. Okay, so let's break it down. We play this A minor 9. Then the right hand will play a little melody. So here we play B F sharp and the F sharp will flick into a G like this. And then we play quickly F sharp E into the next chord which is B minor 7. And then from here we just repeat the right hand once. The whole thing sounds just like this. Three, four. Very good. So let's play it together twice. Three, four. Very good. Then from here we'll play this A minor 9. Okay? So from here. And. Okay, let's break it down. We played A minor 9. So the new inversion. Then we'll play B minor 7 like this. So it goes 1, 2, 3, 4 into D minor 9 this time. And we'll play a C with the pinky. So it goes. And we'll end up this little section with the C major over F sharp. And we play it like this. So here, please take notes. I'll play a C major triad here and one octave higher. But the left hand is going to play octave F sharp. But I won't hold it. In the actual song, the F bass, F sharp bass, does not resonate here. So we play this. Instead of... Okay. So let's repeat from... The A minor 9. It goes like this. 3, 4, 1, 2, and 3, 4, and 1, 2, 3, 4. Very nice. Okay, now we'll play this little section once again, but we'll change the ending. So once again we play A minor 9 into B minor 7 to D minor 9. This time we won't play a top C, we just play this. And then we'll play a 2-5-1. And the chord we are on will be the 2. If it will go 2, 5, and 1. So 2-5-1 in C major. Let's break it down. We start on D minor 9. Then we play the G9 add 13. So we just take the C down to the B on the right hand and we'll add a G bass. Then we'll play this chord on the right hand, which is a simple G7. We have B, F, G. B, 3rd, 7th, root, 3rd, and we'll end up on this C major 7 chord. Okay, so that's quite a lot. Let's play just the 2-5-1. 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, and 1. Very good. Then from here, we'll play the E7 flat 9. 
very nice, that will resolve into the C major 7, the last chord of this progression. And from here, we'll repeat the right hand and we'll add an F sharp bass in octave. And we'll play this melody, G, A, B, and back to the very first chord of this progression. So the ending sounds just like this, from the E7 flat 9, 3, 4, and... So see, it's really quick in the end. Alright guys, that's all for the first part of this tutorial. If you want to see more, please head over to musicgreatness.com. As always, thank you for watching and if you've liked the video, please leave a like, a comment and subscribe. See you in the next lesson.